Alright, what's going on everybody? It's Tristan and today I'm back in the college dorm man and uh, we are here with another video and I'm here with the Huck Dude Cop and I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get the Jordan 4 Starfish uh, which is dropping in women's sizing only for just you guys information really quickly off the bat but this is still a shoe that you might want to go for because I still see some profit on it if you are just going to resell it or if you just want to get it because it personally you know you think it's a good sneaker I'll be showing you guys how you can really do that in this video so I hope you guys will enjoy it again if you want more how to cop content like this sneaker investment videos uh, reselling videos I'm definitely going to be making some content on that in the next couple of days um, you know just because it's been requested so subscribe and like if that's what you're interested in again the goal on this video I want to switch it up a little bit let's make the goal 222 likes that's what I want the goal to be 222 likes something, something a little different you know usually I say 200 but I don't know let's try like 222 like some random number like that so if everybody that watches could do that I'd appreciate it um, and if you also want to in the description my discord is down there it's a great little community uh, but really just again sneaker community so we just talk about shoes or really anything you can seriously anything but yeah anything appropriate but let's go so as you guys can see my classic saying that I always go with we are here with the screen recording so on, on the screens again just my Instagram stick down below in the description if you want to go give me a follow uh, again I do not know when I'm going to post I think one is bound to happen soon but I've just I've been posting on Instagram in a while I'm posting my story but just I don't I don't I don't know I don't, I don't really want to post but aside from that let's really just get into the video right here to kind of discuss how to cop this release so the women's Air Jordan 4 Starfish uh, this one is retailing at $200 so it is a bit more expensive again as you know this is a typical Jordan 4 retail but Jordan 4s are more expensive just kind of um you know with the retail price off the bat same with even the grade school sizes they're like already uh, I think grade school sizes like 150 here um here hold on if you'll let me scroll down and like show you all I don't even think it's loaded up yet it would load up on my phone but the grade school sizes i think are like 152 so they're also they're also you know fairly expensive but this isn't something to be concerned about so just remember again these ones are dropping on january 22nd at 10 a.m eastern time that's the date you want to remember for the u.s i think on the eu it might be dropping the day before but I think, that, I think it's dropping at the same time everywhere from what I know, from what I've checked. So I really wouldn't be too concerned about missing the date. Just remember, January 22nd, 10 a.m. Eastern time. Some places have been saying the 21st, but obviously if sneakers itself says the 22nd, then it's dropping on the 22nd. So let's not hope for any delays or anything. Let's really just hope this one kind of drops off the bat. Uh, I've seen them push up, uh, push stuff back a little bit, and I think this one's already been pushed back like a couple days, but I'm pretty sure it's still gonna release. So aside from that, um, this one again kind of features a gray and kind of orange, I guess, colorway kind of all over it. You even with a little bit of like black, I'd say kind of like right here, um, kind of on this outer portion of the sneaker, like this, um, like, you know, this door, this is the typical thing you see in all Jordan 4s. This is kind of like the only portion that I see. Maybe it's kind of like a darker, like a very, very dark orange, kind of like even towards a brown. Uh, but I think it's just kind of like a black uh, right here. And then you can kind of see like, it's got like this orange outlining throughout the whole sneaker. And I think it's a really good, uh, it's a really interesting design. Like this isn't something that I've seen on most. I mean, again, it's not like uncommon of Nike to do something like this uh, design wise personally. I don't know if I like these really. I mean, again, I don't think they're ugly at all. Uh, but I mean, again, it's still something that you definitely would want to go for because uh, I think some people are definitely going to want this one. It's going to catch some people's attention. It's kind of like clean and simple. So this one would definitely be a shoe. It's like really easy to wear. If you kind of notice that, like this is not a shoe that I'd be like, oh man, I can't wear this. Like this is something I could wear with a lot of outfits because it's just simple. And uh, you know, it is a little bit different though. So, you know, you're, you're stunting a little bit when you wear it. But aside from that, that's just sound a little random, I guess. But let's just kind of get into the resale right now. So with the, it's not many sales right now on StockX, but you kind of go look at what most are selling for right now. Um, a lot of people are trying to get their pairs off right now for, I think it's around that range. Like you go look at some of the sales, it's around a range of like 290 to 280 kind of, uh, even some falling around like some of the smaller sizes. Like this would be, uh, since it's woman size only, this would be equivalent to a size six in men's, like sizes uh, seven and a half or selling for like 250 right now, which I think is fine. Again, I do not see these ones bricking. I see them maybe only having a little bit of profit at first. Like I could be honest with you all, uh, the best sizes to go for on this one are going to be sizes uh, eight, eight and a half uh, W through 12 W because again eight and a half W would be a size seven in men's um, and I think you know a size seven is always a great size to maybe even hold this one as a hold I don't think it would be too shabby you know you know I think it'd be all right I don't think it'd be an amazing hold I, you know I just think it'd be something like it's kind of one of those that it might take a long a long time I mean fours have been doing really well recently metallic fours went up fire red fours and even normal sizes have started going up grade school sizes they spiked up um like literally all the metallic fours went up i mean fours are in right now so they're popular so these ones could be a good hold i definitely think maybe until uh, the winter time like this christmas of this year so like maybe you could hold them until christmas 2021 and i could see these ones maybe in again that size uh eight and a half up uh, through 12 w range i could definitely see them then going at a higher price but i don't exactly know where because personally if i get these i probably am just going to flip them i'm going to try and get multiple pairs because i don't see them flipping that heavy so my personalized resale estimation at first 
versus around 240 to 270. Maybe a little bit more again if you get like a size 12W because that'd be like a 10 in men's. Um, but I mean, it's, it's just, we kind of have to see on this one. I don't think it's going to brick, uh, but it, it really depends on how many pairs release. Like if not a lot of pairs end up dropping on sneakers here, uh, then this one is definitely going to be one that flips for, you know, a lot more and it's going to be worth your money more in the future. You know what I mean? But if it's just one that like is, you know, heavy stock, like kind of any retro type thing, uh, then I don't really see this one being one that, you know, it's going to be like a hold, you know what I mean? I wouldn't hold it properly. But aside from that, let's kind of get into how to cop this sneaker right now because I definitely wanted to do that and really uh, discuss where uh, some places that, you know, I can kind of show you all work, direct you to how to cop. So uh, I made this video down below if you guys want to go check this in the description. It really shows you guys how you can cop off the sneakers app manually, really giving a full breakdown of it and what you need to do, like everything that you would kind of have to do this year uh, to like have success and what I've done, you know, have success in Bolt Golds, Unions, Lucky Greens. Uh, I'm trying to think. There, there's, there's some other sneaker drops I've hit on. Those are just like a couple I've named off the top of my head. But this is like the same methods I use right here uh, in this video and I kind of discuss it. So uh, yeah, I also want to say you guys can screenshot this notepad too because like this notepad is kind of full of like advice and it's really what I discuss in the video, just kind of discussing how to make like multiple different uh, accounts and sneakers because again, sneakers is just like a lottery. The more accounts that you have entered in that lottery, like think of one account um, that you enter like per drop as a ticket. So like if you have five accounts, that's five tickets, two accounts, two tickets, one account, one ticket. You would rather have five tickets than like two or one ticket, you know? I mean so I really discuss how you can set up multiple accounts in this video safely and uh, not take any L's really so that's really what I do and I also discuss you know I want to update this little portion of it when I do discuss this if you're um, making making multiple accounts and putting in your address when making multiple accounts the room one room two room three trick has had a lot of trouble recently again you can put it before if it doesn't work um, and another trick that I really want to point out to you, you don't have to do the room one room two room three for each account um, you can also if you live on like a road or like an avenue then you can just put the abbreviation like put um, instead of typing out road you can put RD and then instead of typing out Avenue you can just put Av um, for one of your accounts and that also works that's kind of as like jigging your address too because they would think it's still two different places they wouldn't be able to tell so just some quick advice there and also you know some other quick advice I'll spit off the, um, the top right here uh, you can use a credit card on up to five sneakers accounts safely do not forget that so if you have a credit card you can use that on up to five accounts and don't forget you can use up to five accounts on one home network uh, safely without really getting um, like blocked or getting your IP banned or anything. So that's really what I would do. I'm really at college right now, so I could probably run a lot, you know, run a few more, but who knows? I'm still, you know, running mo my multiple accounts and having good success. So I'm happy about that. But aside from that, that's really, again, how you cop off uh, sneakers right there. That's my full breakdown of like what you would need to do specifically um, for like a sneakers release. Again, that video is down below. So I'd appreciate it if you guys would check that out and hopefully screenshot of that notepad. But I also want to give a huge shout out to my boys at Secret Sauce right here because these guys, they'll be down below in the description, but these guys are a cook group that can cop a lot of releases just like this one for you. Again, they cooked up huge in the Volt Golds recently. Like you can go check their success. A lot of people have been hitting on a lot of recent drops. Like look, there, there's I, I've already scrolled and you guys can see like there's plenty of people that have got multiple pairs of Volts in. Like they really help people with like copying because they have many services like uh, they have slots and they also provide insider info early links like monitors stuff that would really help like a manual user and like help somebody that's like trying to get into botting maybe they can really help that out uh, and they are a $60 monthly fee but I do want to explain that they are 100% worth it with the $60 monthly fee because uh, the $60 monthly fee like you can easily make that back super fast like they have all the opportunities that they provide in there like the slots that they provide I really want to explain that because that's the main thing that they would provide in there that could help uh, cop for you so basically they run these tickets in there or they call them slots Tickets basically are these forms and then basically if you get the chance to run a ticket with them then they're basically they will drop this form and you would just put in your payment info and shipping info i've done this plenty of times again and i've gotten uh yeezy Aceris, i've gotten two pairs of yeezy breads two pairs of yeezy carbons supreme mortal combat arcade machine i mean the list goes on but like you know i always kind of just mention those things but they've really caught me a lot of stuff and continued to so shout out them and uh, basically you know if you got the chance to run uh you would do the same thing if you got the chance again you would just fill that form and then they'd take that form and put it into their bots and then cop releases for you so it's really great and uh these guys again can really up your game so shout out to them and they can really um you know again help you even get into like showing you guys how to cop the stuff by yourself so you know if you're not just don't even want to rely on them with their slots then they can even show you, you know kind of the reps yourself which is great so they'll be linked down below if you're interested in joining this group chat again just go to their twitter and send them a message letting them know that i sent you i just be like yo tristan sent me uh how can i get into the group and then you know they'll pretty much let you in that way but aside from that they also got like proxies down below so again if you're running like bots uh, these proxies are really, really good and I recommend them. So you can go check them down below too. Um, so yeah, aside from that, 
uh, I also, aside from No Secret Sauce and Copping Off Sneakers specifically, I was checking for raffles on these places, and I was checking, um, again, I'll link raffle sneakers down below, and I would continue to check this link every few days to see if more raffles appear. Again, if this one ends up not having any raffles, then that means it would be like kind of like a sneakers exclusive, um, but I think some raffles will eventually appear, so you guys can check this link every few days to see if some do appear. I think it's bound to happen, but if no raffles end up happening for the Air Jordan 4 Starfish, then this one is definitely going to be one I think would be a good hold because that probably would mean that there will be less pairs and I don't see this one sitting on sneakers especially in those sizes like 12w like that's a 10 and a half in men's like you know people are going to be wanting that because I see some guys definitely wanting these like you know these shoes uh woman sizing and always it's always kind of interesting because like the people with bigger feet are completely left out which you know I feel bad for y'all if you wear like a size 11 then you can't wear the shoe basically uh because you know they don't make a size that you know would fit you because 12w is only a 10 and a half to men's but aside from that I checked everywhere for raffles sneaker Torius. There's only really maybe like some Foot Locker and like finish line raffles going on right now for these ones, but it's really just like probably going to be dropping on sneakers as of right now. And I don't see anything about foot sites yet or anything carrying this one. So if it is a sneakers exclusive, that would kind of change it up. I even checked sneaker news uh, and there's nothing like it just saying Nike sneakers and that's it on January 21st. But again, it is not dropping on the 21st. It is dropping on the 22nd right here, as you guys can see clearly on my screen. So do not forget about that. But yeah, again, that's really how you guys would cop the Air Jordan 4 Starfish, really everything you would need to do, uh, like how you cop it off sneakers, the raffles. Again, I'll leave the link down below because I feel like some will be coming eventually maybe even some stuff with some foot sight drops but there's nothing about it yet so no foot sites announcing these probably no foot sites having them so i see these ones doing good and being a little excuse me but a little bit of profit at first there at least so that's really all i have to say i'm gonna end the screen recording so do not forget keep your eyes on these i think it's definitely going to be worth it a little bit so What's really the outro? My bad, I got distracted by my phone there, but I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Again, if you want more content just like this video, feel free to go ahead and subscribe below and also drop a like. Huge shout out to my boys at Secret Sauce as always. Um, and don't forget the interesting like goal we got in this video, 222 likes, but uh, it, it doesn't really matter to me if we do or don't hit that goal. I really just hope this video was helpful to you guys. If you have any questions, I'll answer them down below. You, you already know I'm always in my comment section. I'm always seeing the comments. Uh, re really whatever it is, you know, I'm just trying to help people out, you know, help make your day a little bit better, make it a little bit easier with these videos uh, so you at least know what you're doing when the release time comes. So don't forget, January 22nd, 10 a.m. Eastern time, be there. That's when these are dropping. You can make some money, at least like I'd say 40, 50 bucks. So, you know, you don't want to miss out on that. And especially in those base sizes, that's where you want to go. And don't forget, these are women's sizing. So that, I feel like they're going to take off because, you know, some fours and women's sizing. But that's just what I'm saying. But uh, again, if you want to also check my Instagrams and Discord down below, those are right there in the description. I'd appreciate that. Um, but I don't want to just keep bombarding you with, you know, um, with like, you know, say go follow this, go check that. It's, it's all down there in the description if you want to check it, if you're even interested in it. But that's all I'm going to say. Uh, stay hydrated with a nice little Fiji water, you know. I guess, you know, we're paying too much for water now. But <laughs> I'm just messing around. I love you all. And I'll see you all in the next vid. Peace.